welcome back college football. I'm Nathan Epstein, Old Dominion, hoping for no such upset. Tonight, Coach Bobby Wilder's team opening the 2017 season with Albany at SB Ballard Stadium. Brian Parsons was there, and he joins us with the game recap. Old Dominion has never lost to an FCS program since moving up to FBS. Today's opponent, Albany, a top-tier team from the CAA, so no gimme by any stretch. Redshirt sophomore Blake LaRussa making his first college start. First quarter, LaRussa hurried, and that's an interception. However, on the very next play for Old Dominion, the Monarchs are going to get the ball right back. Marvin Branch from Suffolk jumps in front of the receiver, and he gets the interception, and that led to this. Ray Lowry, he's a senior now, and he's going to break outside. Keeps his feet in bounds, and the baby bull is off. 41-yard touchdown to give ODU a 7-0 lead to the second quarter. LaRussa going to keep it, and it looks like he's going to run it, but he sidearms it to Javonta Jackson, who sprints down the sidelines and takes it inside the five. He would score a couple of plays later to make it 21 to three. It was 24 to three at the half, and that's when the rain started to fall. Albany cut it to 24-17 in the fourth quarter, but here's where ODU sealed the deal. Blake LaRussa puts it right in Jonathan Duhart's bread basket. Duhart takes it in for the score, 55-yard play, Bobby Wilder actually played junior college transfer Jordan Hoy at quarterback in the game as well. Monarchs win it 31 to 17 in the season opener. I thought both quarterbacks were great. It was rainy, it was windy, uh, it was not a fun night uh, to play quarterback and they completed a high percentage of their footballs. Overall, both quarterbacks did a good job and it's something we can build on. It wasn't pretty. Um, we won though, so we're, we're happy about that. Um, Excited to come in tomorrow morning and get better from the film, though. Next week, it's on the road for Old Dominion. They play a non-conference game at the University of Massachusetts. In Norfolk, Brian Parsons for the Sports Wrap.